This intersection has become a problem. Butler and Humboldt. As a result, on Monday, someone hit this house. And now residents want to know what's being done by those in power. Monday, this car slammed into this home. Damage, as you can see from the outside, extensive. The same is true inside. Residents tell me they want the city to do something. They're only going to listen when somebody get killed or seriously injured. And then they're going to come over here and try to do something. Two on your side took the concern to the Maston District Councilman. They've been complaining for a long time that nothing's being done about the traffic patterns. Um, as a councilman, what can you do? What have you done? We've been trying to come up with solutions for years. This house used to have planters on the corner. But a snowplow destroyed it. Is the solution maybe making Butler one way in the opposite direction? A few of the solutions that we've been talking about and kicking around was to reverse the one-way traffic on Butler so that there's no need to turn right off of the 33. What is the process that needs to happen? Have you talked to the Department of Engineering, Public Works, to make a change? I've been hearing this complaint for seven years, mm. and I've been trying to get some work done here for the last seven years, once that had come to my attention. Maybe this now is the reason and the time for us to move more swiftly on getting things done for our residents. Will changes come? Will the traffic pattern change here on Humboldt Parkway near Butler? That remains to be seen. On your side in Buffalo, Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News.